little quick video for you. Um, I'm gonna make a kind of like a matchbox, but with like a holder for a necklace on it. Uh, I was gonna say, sorry, it's another like indoor making type video, but it's just by chance I never get the much chance lately to go down the woods or anything. It's just always been working or whatever, coming home, resting on the weekend, got to do something. So we're going to make like a matchbox out of a shotgun cartridge. Going to take one of these caps off, put it on the end, and that's going to be the cap. And we're going to see if we can make a little leather holder for it. So first of all, you've got heat. Oh, make sure it's been fired. These are all old empty ones. Heat this end up so you can pull it off. So all you need is a candle, just hold this over here and just keep heating it up until it will come off. But obviously remember not to grab it with your hand, you need something to pull it off with. So like I was saying, just as of late, I've not had much chance to get down the woods or do anything much, but the only time I kind of get to myself lately is in the evenings. It's too late to get down the woods. Weekends I've always ended up having stuff to do. So that's why you're getting a lot of like at home indoor videos. Yeah, starting to come a bit. It needs to go a bit more. Try it again. nearly coming off but just remember this is going to be red hot this cartridge ends just be careful I've done this before where I've forgotten what I'm doing pulled it off and went to pull it off with my hand Right, I just, I just accidentally while I was, what I was gonna do, I'll show you pulling it off. But what I'd done, I was just doing this, dropped it into the candle, put the candle out, and then just yanked it. So you just keep heating it up, pull this, and you can pull it out. Now sometimes you can even get that bit there out, but as that's still in there, we'll have to leave it in there for now. So now what you need to do, let that cool down. While that's cooling down, we'll get this cartridge and you've got your flared bit on the end, we're going to cut that off a bit. You could leave it on if you want it longer, but that'll do for a matchbox. how hot this is no right, I'm just gonna use my trouser leg just to wipe this off you just want to wipe the black off what you put on it make sure you haven't squashed it and that should go back on here as a lid still a bit hot actually but 
I've slightly squashed it that way as well. Oh, I've got that on there now. Just takes a little bit of twisting. So if you could have got a bit more of that out inside, this would go on even further. But that would just, all it needs to do, you need to heat it up a bit longer before you pull it and you'll pull the entire lot out of it. But that'll do for this. So next I've got a small bit of leather. So we're going to kind of do something like this and then fold this one over and just put a rivet or a pop rivet whatever in there. Well, hopefully, if this will go through all three of these, that's all I've got to do. But I bet this won't. Well, that's enough to mark it. Gone through two. The last one. Yep. Hopefully, didn't do the hole big enough. We'll do it blue side out, whatever. As I've made the other side of the lever all filthy now with my black hands. Now this isn't the right tool for this size rivets, but it's made it look weird. It's going to hold, but it actually doesn't look too bad, but that's not how you'd actually would want it really to come out like that. It's supposed to come out like let me move forward. It's supposed to come out like that. And this one has come out like that. Because it's the wrong size tool. for these ones, but it's done the job what we need it to do. So now, I'll do a little bit of trimming. Not nothing special, but now we got a little matchbox. 
goes in there. This, put your matches or whatever you want in there. This goes back on this end. And that can be worn either around a necklace or something like that. There you go, something like that. Look. Little holder, simple. Anyone with minimal skills could make that quite easy. String, bit of leather, one rivet, or you could actually do that just by stitching that, you know. Four little holes, or two, even two holes, and just stitch it through with some strong cord. What I might try later on is get that out of there so this will go on even further. But anyway, a little matchbox or container you could make. Alright, anyway, cheers for watching and I'll see you later. If you like that video, then why don't you share it with your friends? And also, if you want to see regular videos like this, and subscribe to my channel. Thanks a lot for watching. If you want to get full notifications for my channel, go to this little gear symbol next to where it says subscribed. Click on that and here where it says send me all notifications for this channel. Click on that and then save it.